All right, I can see more how funky you what Jerry is saying that Friday briefing is not Friday briefing without Willis the word master, and therefore we've gotten him. We've sorted out the technical issues. Willis, how are you this evening? Serious fans are demanding their rights. <laughs> Betty, I'm fine, but I don't know why these technical problems every now and again, but whichever way, you know, some machines or these machines cannot be controlled at certain points of time. Right, Willis. It also makes everything spicy, you know. Live broadcast is all about, you know, <laughs> adrenaline, Willis. Great to see you, Willis, tonight. I'm <laughs> it sure happens. You... It yeah. happens, yeah. Betty. Yeah. All right, Willis. So... Tonight we have a serious lesson and I want us to start by taking a look at uh, Word on the Street, why don't we? And then we'll talk about it. Debut, 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 Ignandi, debut. Debat. 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 Debut. Debut. Wow, Willis. I'm sure you've heard it for yourself. I don't even need to say any more. You've had debat, debut, debut. <laughs> so how do we go about that one, Willis? <laughs> <laughs> but it happens. I always use that, you know, phrase or statement, it happens. You know, some of these things, we can't assume that they cannot happen because, you know, somebody may say uh, debut, uh, debut, and all that. But the correct or acceptable pronunciation of that word is debut, or you can also say debut. So it's day or day, but you say bu, not boot, not but. <laughs> Debut, debut. Debut, got it, got it Willis, debut. And um, so where's the stress? Could it also be debut, um, to debut? No, the stress is on uh, what we call now the first syllable, at the onset, at okay. the beginning. Debut, debut, debut. or debut. Debut, okay, yes. got it Willis. Let's move on to another word, now this one. Hey, this one gives people problems, I'm telling you Willis. Eyebrows. You know, I've had eyebrows so many times. At least this one, uh, you taught me a long Avoid time ago how we say that. it. Mm. Eyebrows, no. <laughs> you say eyebrows, brows. Eyebrows. Many people talk of bros, yeah. eyebrows, mm. which is not the case. Mm. You say eyebrows, brows. Eyebrows. All right, got it, Willis. Eyebrows, eyebrows. Moving on to the next one. I'll spell this one out because I'm not even sure about it. X... E R O X, Xerox, or how do you go about that you one? You say Z, Xerox, Xerox, not Xerox, not Xerox. You say Xerox. <laughs> Xerox. Okay, Willis. It reminds me of this word, Willis, that you taught us a couple of uh, months ago, that we say xylophone and not xylophone. Is that correct? Yes. Not ex ex xylophone, no. Okay. You say xy xylophone. Xylophone, xylophone. Willis got it. Moving on to the next word. Do you say <laughs> feasibility or feasibility? Like a feasibility study? Is that correct? That letter S takes the voiced sound, Betty. It takes the voiced sound z. z. So you say feas feasibility. Not fees or feasibility. Uh, Z. Okay, feasibility. Yes. Got it. So I was not even far farther from yeah, that. Fee, yes. Okay. Moving on to another word. It also has this s and z and um, closer or closer, like closer to me or closer to me. Which oh, is which? That is a tricky one, Betty. Uh huh. You know, we have the word close to close. That is a verb. Yeah. But when we talk of the adjective, you say close, close. So we say closer. Can you move closer, not closer? Closer, no. Closer. Closest. Okay. Close, closer, closest. Not closer. 
So that z should not be used when you are talking of closer. Okay. So I'm, I'm even confused now. So yes. let's say you want to say, I want to shut the door. Do you say I want to close the door or close the door? You are talking about the verb, Betty. Yeah. That is the, the, the word that expresses the action. the action. So in that case, you say close. Okay. Z, z, Just close. checking. Can you okay. close the door? All right. But okay. can you move closer? Closer. Okay. closer. It is close. Uh -huh. Close. All right. Yes. Got it, Willis. Got it. Moving on to this other word, uh, P-R-E-C-I-N-T. Do we say precinct, precinct, precinct? <laughs> How do we go about that one? Pre, precinct, precinct. The precincts of something. Pre, uh. not pre. Okay. Precincts of something. Uh. Pre precinct. Okay, got it, Willis. Moving on to this other one. Do we say, actually, let me just spell it out. I'm not sure. C O N S U L. Consul. Or you say consul. 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 Console. So you have sell. Cons yes, console. All right. A console. All right. Yes. Console. Moving on to this other word. Do we say menace, menace? Um, how do we go about that one? You say menace, menace. Oh. What you'll realize, menace. especially for a phonetician, uh -huh. is the second sound, e, mm -hmm. is weaker. It's a weak sound, e. Eh. Menace, menace, eh. <laughs> but don't say menace. We also say palace, palace, not palace. You may hear palace, especially in movies, but the correct or accurate pronunciation of that word is palace. Menace, palace. palace. All right. Okay, Willis, got it. Now, we have another word that we've been using quite a lot, uh, especially during news. Uh, broadcasts and we're talking about drought or drought famine or famine how do we say this avoid two drought okay don't say drought mm -hmm. don't say drought drought and drought just avoid those ones you say drought drought uh. d-r-o-u-g-h-t uh -huh. is drought. drought then we talk of famine famine, famine. not famine all right. Mine, no. Famine, determine, not determine. <laughs> Famine, determine, determine, right. mm. not determine. Not determine. Got it, Willis. Uh, before we move on to our yes. feedback question from uh, our text messages, I'd like to, to do one here from Bilo Sangoman. He's asking about synagogue, synagogue. How do we say that? Is that is it C or Sai? You say synagogue. All right, synagogue. C, synagogue. Okay. Betty, synagogue. you say synagogue. Uh -huh. You also say synod, not synod. All right. You synod. also say sycophant, sycophant, not psychophant. Oh. The way it's said, you know, locally, sycophant, synod, synagogue, system, not system. <laughs> you can also say system, but right, system. System, no. Wow, interesting, Willis. The because list is long, my dear you, sister. Yeah, because you hear a lot of psychophant. I'm so guilty of that. I say psychophant all the time. So it's actually wrong. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Yeah, so we have psychology, but yeah. not psychophant. Psychology, the one which begins with the letter P, which is silent, you yeah. say psychology, but psychophant. Psychophant. Psychophant, psychophant not psy. I've learned something today. All right, Willis, let's move on to our feedback question. It's coming from Esther Waruri of Nairobi. She's asking about this word. Do we say bizak, basak? Um, how do we say this word, Willis? Betty, that word has uh, two acceptable pronunciations which function as alternatives. Just like we have finance and finance. That word also you can say bazak or Basak, Sak or Zak. Oh. Basak, he went Basak. Oh. He went Bazak. So S and Z are acceptable when you are pronouncing that word. So Esther Waruri, 
you can catch that together with our dear viewers. All right. Then please. Mohammed Ahmed, I think this must be Mohammed Funky. Mohammed uh, Funky, who he's is asking about poverty, poverty, and yeah. all that. You uh -huh. say pover, poverty, poverty, poverty levels. Poverty. Lilian Halai Pendo, Lilian Halai Pendo, you say committee, committee. But that O is a sure, a weak vowel sound. <laughs> oh, committee. Just like oppose. Oppose, oppose. Committee. committee. So you should take you know, note of that. Masinde Waswa, you say fiscal. That is F I S C A L, fiscal, like fiscal policy. Yes. You talk of physical, physical. That is P H Y S I C A L, physical. Physical. Nelly Hassan, you say, yeah, physical. Physical mm. or physical. Yeah. But the other one which begins with F is fiscal. 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 All right. Then we have veterinary or veterinary. Veterinary or veterinary. Nelly Hassan, you can catch that. But the person is a veterinarian. Veterinarian. So you should be getting it because that is a bit tricky. Very it's like tricky. restaurant or restaurant but restaurant. you avoid restaurant. Paolo Munguti, yeah. you say an omelette. omelette. Omelette, not omelette. You say an omelette. Yes, Sami Mwada, claustrophobia. Claustrophobia. Don't say claustro. Claustrophobia. Ali Kamtiko, that is Ali, Sudan if you like. I think that is the other name. Mm. Kamtiko and Charles Akwenda. Charles Akwenda of Nairobi, Thank you, because I think he also asked about drought. Okay. Drought. All but right. I hope you've gotten it, or you've got it right, got my it. brother. Francis Lopau, you say demon and konosa. Konosa. Not konoiseur. <laughs> konosa. Then <laughs> demon, <laughs> not demon. Then melee. Melee. <laughs> Goldmouth. Melee. Many people say melee, Betty. I said that earlier But it's today. melee. That is M-E-L-E-E. -E. Melee. Melee. Okay, got and it. I think that one is from Fred Moturi. All right. Finally, Lilian Akelo, you say hers. The hers. That vehicle carrying, you know, a dead body or which is used uh, uh, when you have, you know, somebody who is dead is being escorted or that body is being escorted. We talk of the hers, not yeah. the hears. The surprise word, Betty, for yes. tonight hey. is right here with us. That was heavy. <laughs> uh -huh. And I know you know, I'm sure you can remember what many people say. Many people talk of Klaus. Klaus. Some say Klaus. But we say claw. Claws. The claws. All right. Not the Klaus. Not okay. the Klaus. Okay. Klaus and Klaus, no. no. You say Close. Close. What happens, that A and U in that uh -huh. word form, it's what we call a digraph. Mm -hmm. A and U digraph. representing the long vowel sound O. Then Betty, have you heard of blessed and blessed and Ye blessed? Yeah. I want to clear the air about those words tonight. Mm -hmm. Betty, when we talk of blessed for this word, blessed, that is the past tense of the verb bless. Mm -hmm. He blessed us this morning. Right. He blessed the child this morning. Blessed. That is past tense of bless. Okay. So this is very tricky. And what I've done down here is what we call the phonetic transcription. So you see blessed. blessed. That is the past tense of the verb bless. All right. But when we are talking about the adjective, mm -hmm. like, you know, we sometimes say, blessed are the poor. Right. Blessed are the poor. Right. You don't now say, blessed are the poor. That is now the adjective. Okay. You say, blessed, or you say, blessed. You can say, blessed with a weak sound, eh, eh. or you say, blessed. So, blessed, blessed are the poor. Okay. Have a blessed weekend. Have a blessed day. So, these are words which really confuse. And when you see words which have... The same spelling, but different pronunciation and yeah. different meanings. Betty, we call them heteronyms. That is in linguistics now. All right. Heteronyms are words which have the same spelling, but, but different, different 
meanings, meanings. and pronunciations. Pronunciations. Eh, Willis. Anything else, my dear sister? Will <laughs> my dear sister. Willis, <laughs> thank you so much. I couldn't <laughs> ask for more. Tonight you've uh, really yes. taken us on a yes. serious uh, journey of pronunciation classes and i will never forget that we say sycophant and not psychophant yeah thank you so much yeah, willis, for that. even my cameraman dan is asking me willis today it's like we were lighting fire right here <laughs> in the kisumu studio but i've just told him that is about business of accurate or acceptable pronunciation of English words. Uh, thank you so much, Willis, and say hi to Dan there. All right, Willis, the word master. Willis, have a blessed weekend. <laughs> blessed weekend, Willis. <laughs> that is it. <laughs> right. That is it. Okay. Well, <laughs> they can reach me on Twitter yeah. at Willis Ocheng one. one. At Willis Ocheng One. But it is Willis with W I Double L I C E, e. Ocheng. All right, one. not not your ordinary Willis. This is a different kind of Willis. W I double L I C E. Not really ordinary. Not ordinary. Ordinary. You know, okay. I always say, <laughs> okay. Betty. Yes, yes. There's nothing about being ordinary in terms of ordinary. names. That is what we call variant spelling. Yes. There is that W I double L I S and W I double L. I see. I see. Mm. Just like Brian oh. with Y and Brian with an I. All Just right. variants. Nothing about being special in terms of the sound. Okay. I also learned one word there, Willis. Ordinary. Ordinary. All right, Willis. Thank you so much. Willis, the word master <laughs> there, joining us from Kisumu County, talking to us about these difficult pronunciations like ordinary, not ordinary, ordinary, <laughs> and sick of phantom.